So EA dropped the new 80 plus combo upgrade. Let's open up a bunch of these and see what we get. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast and reliable ultimate team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description, say 5% using code HABER. These cost six rares and five non-rares and you get a pack containing two players, one guaranteed 80 or above. So they are a guaranteed tunnel pack basically uh well let's open these up and see what we get they are two rare golds i'm just hoping that these aren't going to be absolutely terrible like it's effectively an 80 plus two rare gold player pack it's nothing too special it really isn't but we're gonna open these up and see what we get anyway we're starting off with deji kamada who i am going to discard i'm not going to store these in my SPC section either i'm probably going to store 84 and above but i'm not going to store like 80 rated in there i'm just hoping we can get some walkouts realistically uh cam spain la liga who is, oh is this danny olmo i mean i'd say danny olmo it's not danny olmo no it isn't brilliant okay i don't expect a huge amount from these of course we do still have uh road to the knockouts in packs even though they feel impossible to pack anyway we do have them in packs um and we've obviously got the team of the week in packs as well so there are things to pack other than just walk out, there are things to pack. Haaland! Let's go! We got Haaland! Yes! Sorloth, brilliant. We got ourselves Sorloth and 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 you. I'm discarding both of them. I don't even care. I don't want to fill my SBC storage up with 82 rated cards when SBCs aren't going to require 82 rated. Here we go. Next one's not going to be a walkout again. This is not a great start, is it? If you do open these packs, let me know down below what you guys get in your packs. I'd love to be jealous. So just feel free to flex in the comments down below who you guys get. Leave a like on the video if you guys do enjoy. Subscribe if you guys are new around here as well, as it greatly helps out the channel. We do get ourselves Victor Osman, who I could tell straight away from that uh, silhouette. Just, I think, like, it's becoming easier and easier to, to tell with players. It's becoming easier and easier. Um... I feel like there's not going to be many walkouts now. You won't be able to tell. By about December, I don't think there'll be many walkouts. You won't be able to tell who they are from the silhouette. Or at least that's my prediction. Uh, and the last one of the six that I built originally is going to be an American woman. Who is this? Who are you? Hatch. Down the hatch. Brilliant. Okay. Well, not amazing. But let's go over some more. Right, we've got the hero pack on my second account. The hero pack did not do very well on my main account when we opened it yesterday. It was not great um was not great at all unfortunately i didn't even get a walkout i think i got i think i got dempsey so can we get a hero walkout this time yes we can is that a woman or is that a man is that gooty i think that's gooty eh? i don't know if that's good or not like i've heard really good things about this card but i just think the card doesn't look that great to be honest griezmann in there as well though not bad i mean he's 156k i think a large portion of that is down to the fact that he is a new hero in the game i don't actually think he's that great um looking at it though he, he looks all right you know he's got finesse shot he's got ping pass flare press proven and incisive pass plus griezmann is good behind that though griezmann oh my word wow Wow, what a pack that is. What a pack that is. Hyung Min Son, Antoine Griezmann, and Guti. Wow, what a pack that is. Oh my word. The pack is really good. The hero ruined it. Bro, look at that. That's a strike partnership of dreams right there. That actually is. Oh my word. What a pack that is. All right, hero pack for Nathan now. Let's see what Nathan's about to get in his hero pack. Come on, EA. It is a walkout hero, which is very good. Cam, it's Nakata. I don't know. Is that good or not? I don't really know. I think the card looks good, especially for this time of the year. He's about 174k. Diani in there as well is not bad. We'll take that. Diani solid. She's probably worth a little bit. Good super sub. This Nakata card looks nice, to be honest. Um, it can play playmaker plus plus or playmaker plus as a center mid four star four star That's not a bad card, especially with uh, Varane's SBC Kefram Taram's SBC Marcus Taram's SBC the Syria right now is a sought after league So that's actually a really really nice card Then you got Diani there who's worth about 50 60 K great super sub off the bench and road to the knockout Goncalo Ignacio just hiding there in the duplicates. It's not the best pack in the world, but we got dopamine. We got dopamine from that pack. So I'll happily take the dopamine. We'll take that. All right. We have Moltown's hero pack next. And I said I would buy it for another viewer if we get a 400k plus pull. 
So if we get someone worth 400k or more, I'll buy one more of these for another viewer. Let's see who we get. Oh my God, we've done it. We've just packed an icon. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Surely, surely we've done it. Surely. Wait, it's Davos Suka. He might not be. He might not be. Wait, he actually might not be 400k. Oh my word, what a pack. <laughs> How much is Davos Suka then? All right, Davos Suka, 195k. Williams is 110k. Unless there is the craziest dangler of all danglers ever. We'll find out. No, there's not. So my bank account is saved. But what a pack that is. Icon and a hero. Double walkout. That is sensational. That is absolutely sensational. You love to see it. Icon and a hero. Double walkout, man. That is just that is a thing of beauty. I'm really glad that we just got to see that, to be honest. Unfortunately, there's uh, there's no 400k plus player there. So my bank account is saved. Get in there. Love that. All right. Because we got an icon and a hero double walkout, even though it wasn't a, a 400k plus pool, I just... I felt like we had to go and get, the, you know what I mean? We had to go and get Ben the pack because I can't sit there and get an icon hero and not do it. So we had to, why not? Let's go. Who is he going to get? He's got himself a hero, a striker from Sweden in the Serie A. It's Brolin, who's actually not a bad card this year. Brolin's actually solid. Um, I don't know if he's worth a lot. Chloe Kelly there as well. Brolin's 340k. Wow, he's more than I thought he was. That card looks good. That card looks very, very good. Technical plus with power shot, incisive, and first touch. Can play false nine, playmaker as a cam, or wide playmaker as a right winger as well. Chloe Kelly in there as well. Not bad. Anyone else? Any danglers? Ford, white. It's not insane, but that's not a bad card. Four star skills, five foot nine, explosive. Like, that's a decent card in my opinion. Um, any danglers, like, in the dupes maybe or something? No. But it's all right. 340,000 coins. You'll take it. Solid. You know, that was that was all right. An RTTK Week 2 Foundation Pack. It's an Inform. Pajor. Wrighton. Uh, it's, is it Dufour? Dufour. Not even a double walkout either. Oh, that's pain. Not even a double walkout. Not even a double. How is Casemiro your next highest rated player? Pain. Absolute pain. All right, we've got 10 more of these now for Lala. We've had one walkout in six so far, which I don't think is a terrible return for these. Like I said, they are six rares and five non-rares. So in terms of price, if you're getting rares for like 650 coins, you're probably paying what, like five and a half K per pack, something like that, which is not awful. Um, there'll be a lot of people saying, oh, I'll go and build uh, gold upgrades for this as well. And you can, like realistically, a gold upgrade is significantly cheaper and the only difference is one of the players is 80 plus versus a gold upgrade where there is no rating minimum so to be honest it's probably not the worst idea in the world to build gold upgrades i'd probably build these on the basis that i think rares are cheap anyway i open a lot of packs get a lot of rares regardless um so i'm not too bothered but yeah gold upgrades are cheaper so if you are if if, if you don't want to go and spend the sort of five and a half six k per pack you want to spend like three and a half four k per pack you can do gold upgrades but i don't know i don't know if it's worth like it, unless you're like really coin pinching like you really need the coins i don't know if it's that worth going and spending a tiny bit less just to not get the guaranteed tunnel because at the same time you get the dopamine from the tunnel as well so there's that uh although this is not looking good this is not looking good at all who's a brazilian center mid from Serie A? it's douglas luis who i don't even i don't even know if he's worth anything i think with the uh Turam sbc i know bremer's gone up quite a lot in price but i don't think douglas luis has walk out here we go center back from germany it is gonna be someone i don't know who is this oh tar of course it's jonathan tar i was so confused it's like i thought it was rudiger and then it wasn't because obviously bundesliga we'll take that 86 not bad We'll take it. We'll take an 86. Would have much preferred Rudiger, but an 86 is okay. Uh, four packs remaining. Let me know in the comments down below, by the way. Who is your best pack pool this year? So far, I've been quite lucky, right? I have packed myself Michael Owen, who I packed over the weekend. That was in the weekend's video. And I've packed um, Mohamed Salah. Other than that, I don't know if I've packed any other cards worth over 100k. I'm trying to think. I don't think I have. My pack look has not been for the amount of spent my pack looks not been good at all so let me know in the comments down below who you guys have packed i'd love to hear that and also to the guy that said that i that i have got the, the amount of personality is his big toe 
Meet me outside, mate. We'll, we'll go right now. I never want to hear that again. If you tell, if you, you know who you are. If you want to meet me outside, we'll go right now. All right, last of La La's 10 packs. Here we go. Come on, EA. Can we get another walkout? No, we don't. So, so far, two walkouts out of 16 packs. It's not the worst return in the world. Wait, who's that? Oh, it's Kamara, isn't it? Kamara from Aston Villa. Not great. Right, we've got 10 more 80 plus combo packs for John. Who's he got here? Who is that? Oh, it's the 80. She's like 84, 85 rated, isn't she? Ford, is it? I think that's Ford. Okay, 85 rated. Not bad. We'll take 85 rated. Not bad. Caitlin Ford. That is solid. Anyone else in there? And an 84 Engen. That is a good pack, to be fair. That's not bad at all. So we've got 10 of these for John. Takes up to 26. So I'm trying to keep a mental note in my head. How many of these we've opened versus how many walkouts we're getting. And then at the end of it, we can kind of get a good idea of how many walkouts we've had and, and things like that, basically. That's what we're trying to keep a mental note of at the moment. No, is that Tamori? Oh, I could, no, it can't be Chris Smalling. That is Tamori. Hey, that is quality. Oh, Big for Kyo Tamori. That's probably the most expensive card we've packed out of these so far. How much is Big Thick? He is 37,000 coins. Oh, that is a W, man. He's quality, by the way. If you've played against his card. Whew, that is a really, really, really good card. We'll take for Kyo Tamori. Not a walkout, but more expensive than most walkouts will pack today. So we'll take that. Yeah, the gold upgrade is better value. We do have a walkout, though. Let's go. Is that... Oh, I thought it would be Declan Rice for a second. It's going to be Granite Xhaka, which we'll take. We'll happily take Granite Xhaka. The flag is a big plus. Uh, 86 rated. Another walkout. So that's three walkouts from going to be a total of 36 packs, right? Oh, no, 26 packs. 20, have we done 26 or 36 so far? Well, after these three, it will be 26, I think. So, so far, we're getting a walkout in every set of 10, basically. Uh, that's not a bad return for an 80 plus combo pack. This should take us to the 30 pack mark. Mahar's got five. I'm just gonna, just to round it, we're gonna go to, th we'll say we've, we've opened 30 of these. Um, so, so far, we've had three walkouts out of 25. It's 26, but who, like, who are you gonna tell? Like, who actually cares, all right? No one cares if it's, tw you know, 25 or 26. Um, but yeah, so we're hoping to try it. I wanna try and average it to like a walkout every 10, or maybe a walkout less than 10 we'll see if we get a walkout out of this set of five then we are looking really really good but it's not looking good so far who is that is that Inigo martinez no it's not it's uh hermoso oh lenormand lenormand thoughts with lenormand because obviously he had that i think he had like a, a brain injury so fingers crossed that he's okay wishing him a speedy recovery next one will be a goalkeeper from argentina I don't know who that is. I have no idea. Ledesma. Brilliant. Espino and Ledesma. These aren't looking good. These aren't looking good at all. All right. Fourth one. Walkout? No. Okay. This set of five is not looking good. Mahars has brought down the luck. Mahars, it's your fault. Jordan Pickford. We get T-Rex art. It's not even. It's, it's Aaron Ramsdale. I forgot he existed. 81 rated this year. All right. The last one. Please give us a walkout. Bring back the average. Please. All right, we've got five for Ruben here. I'm not going to show every single pack we open in this video, but I'll just, like, tell you how many we're on next time we get a walkout. So, like, basically, we'll just see you next time we get a walkout, and then you'll know how many we've opened and, and the averages. Oh, we get a road to the knockout. Hello. Oh, do you know what? I honestly forgot the edge of the thing. I packed it about eight times this week. But we'll take that. That's not bad. I was really hoping for Garnacho there, but... Not bad. We'll take a ZH and tradable 85 rated. I don't know how Galatasaray are doing in the Europa League, to be honest. I actually have absolutely no idea. But if he does get upgrades, it might be an all right card. Probably not. The only use like the only thing I'll say is that card might be usable in like a friendly if we have like a, an objective or something. But apart from that, yeah, it's not a great card. But it's a Rosen knockout anyway. Well, the preseason packs come out on Thursday. I find it very unlikely they drop it on Thursday. The only days I could imagine they drop it. Oh, is that Cole Palmer? Is that, is that cold Palmer? Chippy chips, yeah? No, it's not. <laughs> Trent and Jan Zomer are the two most common walkouts, in my opinion. We do get a walkout here. CB, Portugal, Rubendish. We'll take that. Not bad. That, this is, I think we're just over the 60 pack mark. So it's been about 15, 10 or 15 packs since our last walkout. Um, but we'll take Rubendish. Not bad at all. Um, don't like seeing him at United kit. But we get Leech behind it. United, United. Get in there, my boy. Yeah, that's what, I was, that's what I'm saying. I agree. 
I don't have control, by the way. This is a share screen, not a share play. But I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ruben Diaz, mate. Ruben Diaz. Uh, fair enough. I understand. It's good fodder. But Leech is the best better CB in that pack by a country mile. Back to back? No. Oh, inform. It's not an informed walkout, but it's our first team of the week of the video. It's Tavon Gray from New York. We'll take that. Tavon Gray from New York. It is an inform. Good for SBCs. That's the main thing. And that is like, we're almost at 75 packs now. All right. Walkout. No, I skipped it. We just skipped a walkout. Bunny Shaw and Yokerez. We got another walkout. So this is pack, that was pack like 72 or something like that, I think. Um, we're almost past the 75 pack mark. And we get another walkout, so we'll take it. All right, these are the last three 80 plus combo upgrades to take over 100 combo upgrades on the day. So far, we've had... I don't actually know how many walkouts we've had. I wasn't really keeping track. If anyone can let me know in the comments down below. That's not bad. Alaba's okay. Um, Alaba's actually all right, 85 rated. But I don't actually know how many... Um, I don't know how many walkouts we've actually had in the day. We've had one road to the knockout, one in form. And I want to say like eight walkouts... We haven't quite reached the one walkout per 10 quota I was hoping to reach, but that's okay because these packs aren't insane anyway. They're only 80 plus combo upgrades, um, but we did get to open some hero packs as well. So that's always fun, you know, opening hero packs is always fun. But the last one, pack number 100, we're ending off with a right back from Spain. Excuse me, is Pedro Porro 83 rated? I mean, it's all right. Danilo in there as well. It's okay. It's not amazing. It's okay. Meh. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're not here. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you lads later.